guys, Pixie here and welcome back to my channel. Today, we're back with building the cubic houses. Um, this house is a theme of a of the autumn season as you, as you have already noticed with the title. <laughs> anyways, oh my gosh, I keep saying anyways. I'm sorry. Um here you'll see me play more with the shape of the house because uh, at first I didn't really feel the way the house is looking right now but then when I try playing with it and putting a second floor I decided to remove that and just stick with the one floor so yeah um, this one uh, was inspired by of course the season although here in the Philippines we don't really have the autumn uh, season it's just rainy here because I don't know we're far from, we're not in that region where there's the tropical yeah I, I yeah <laughs> oh my gosh now it's already in geography really anyways <laughs> um yeah i decided to make it make this house just because it fits the the season and yeah so i decide at first i decided the house to be uh red or orange like the wallpaper outside but then later on you'll see that i change it to um the wooden panels because it adds a little um, a little something to the house when it's wood because what i imagine autumn to be is yeah the the colors uh yellow orange red browns um the cozy feeling um and yeah some some like wooden decorations would i say because usually from what i have already watched from other youtubers like um let's see zoella they like buying decorations that involve um wood textures like uh if ever you saw her uh, if ever you saw in pointless vlog or in zoella's videos the hello autumn uh sign yeah i i think it adds to the atmosphere of the autumn season that's why i decided to have that wooden panel wallpaper oh my gosh that's a really long explanation for that anyways um for the inside, it's really a cozy design. I used a lot of those wooden, wooden styled um, furniture, and I used a lot of of objects that I rarely use. For example, is this these counters because if you noticed from my other builds, I really do like using those the modern counters and the modern cabinets like the ones from the kitchen stuff pack and the spa day i usually use those or the base game ones and what else do i rarely use here i rarely use what i put in the bathroom the bed in the bedroom and then the living room and the dining chairs are the same with the white kissed cherry house that i built last time if you if you ever you are curious to what that build is i'll link down the, the i'll put the link in the description box down below <laughs> Whew. anyways again anyways here i wanted to put in some red but then I don't know it didn't really match well with the color that i used for the couch and the tv stand 
So I stick with the orange and then I'll I'll put in some red in the bedroom and then I think I mixed up the colors in the bathroom. Anyways, this house is really small but I mean I I still stick with my theme of just having an 8x8 house because as you have already known from some of you who already watched my previous um, video, I decided to make like if it's like maybe a series where I make a lot of cubic houses although I might not put the word series on the thumbnail or the title I'll just put the house building I, I'll just put it with my house building album so you you just have to check it out down below I'll just leave the link again so yeah here you'll see me put in the red bed which I rarely use because yeah I, I usually do modern builds but just to change it up try I tried to build another cozy house so yeah this time this one doesn't have custom content because there was i think i had a problem with one house build i wasn't able to submit it properly to the sims resource because i used a cc that was converted which is i i can't find where I downloaded it, it downloaded it, it. Oh my gosh, is that a word? Where I download it, downloaded it. <laughs> That's hard. So yeah, I just try to stick with the base, uh, with the in-game content, and then maybe add in some custom content that I already have the links. Like I think the next build that I did would have custom content I think so so yeah I'll just um, if ever you have if ever I wasn't able to put in some um, links in my sims resource uh, submission just check out my youtube channel and then the links for the for the custom content that I have would also be in the description of the video so yeah check it all out anyways we're almost close to the screenshots um thank you for watching guys leave a thumbs up if you enjoyed the video um comment down below any suggestions any thoughts any ideas that you have and yeah subscribe if you want more videos thank you guys for watching see you again next time bye